Hello guys, uh, tonight I would like to share some uh, interesting uh, topic uh, which I never come across to my mind to be honest with you and I just figured out recently, it just clicked uh, it sounds probably like a child or probably stupid but I believe uh, most with other people that who collect this thing it worth every penny or every cent while uh, browsing the internet and then listing all my stuff on eBay try to get to get rid of a lot of stuff that I own which I don't use anymore and then I found out there's a lot of uh, Star Wars fan or Lego fan on the internet or on the YouTube so I spent a couple of days just uh, to browsing around watching YouTube searching on the eBay or Amazon or a lot of review or you know and then just surfing the internet occasionally or and then I found out uh, a lot of people uh, into Lego Star Wars and then I decided you know probably it's good for me to start collect this thing you know put some money into it or probably one day it give me a good investment or a return so guys tonight I will show you uh, a couple of stuff that I bought recently yeah, it's cheap stuff it's not really high-end collectible stuff but I think it's it, a it good start anyway I bought a few magnets uh, Lego magnets Star Wars Lego magnets here I got two this one round 250 each so this one total five pound Star Wars uh, Lego dictionary the visual dictionary it got lights uh, also minifigures there Luke Skywalker with uh, a medal something uh, and then uh, this one for £10 on play.com this one I bought also uh, Frico Speeder uh, contain Anakin Skywalker and Teen Sand the minifigure if you can see over there they got two minifigures what I like to show to you guys the reason I, I said this one probably well worth to invest or to put all your money in because recently on the Amazon and eBay I found out uh, let me show you if you go to Amazon on, or eBay this bloody monster this one Millennium Falcon this one the ultimate collector produced on 2007 uh, initial price I think in United States around 400 bucks but in UK I believe it's less than 400 pound or 400 pound the maximum it cannot go more than that it contains 5195 brick piece uh, set number 10179 uh, from uh, film uh, 4, 5 and 6 I think uh, they got 5 minifigure in this uh, set now if you want to buy this set again it will cost you two thousand pound at least minimum or you can say maximum two thousand pound or probably more or less so imagine within four years from 500 let's say 500 pound let's say i don't know to two thousand pound it's four times more than what you invested initially back to 2004 you know so I believe for for you know for collectible aspect this one really collectible item you buy it keep it somewhere you know it's like brick or gold even though it's just a bit of plastic but he I it high quality and plastic so guys you can go to the internet check this one Millennium Falcon uh, ultimate collector model number 10179 and then you will you can't believe your own eyes I saw it I said come on this thing cannot be true and then I checked on the eBay same around 2,000 pound uh, on the Amazon around 2,000 pound more or less so I hope this one a kick start for me you know uh, investing as well as uh, collecting stuff you know I do collect a lot of stuff like uh, camera uh, some uh, you know antique stuff I would say something like that but this one quite new 
I still learn about it, but I think it's cool stuff. You can play with your children if you have children. If not, you can play with the whole family. Try to build it. It's it's part of learning. Try to learn. I think it's cool stuff to have. And I will start with the visual dictionary. This one ten pound. It got one mini figure. And then can you see the 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 original price around sixteen pound. Based on the page, you see it's not cheap stuff. Have. It have illustration about the minifigures. I think uh, it started uh, from 1999. See, 1999 until 2010. They start. They show you everything. The products, so you can go through everything. It's it's good product, good stuff. This one I think worth to have, at least to give you idea what is uh, available or what is the the molder that they produce some old stuff it costs you more if you try to collect it uh, some new stuff is even cheap the cheapest one I think is around 10 pound 11.99 at least if you not buy from a Lego store it costs you just an, uh, 10 pound you can get at John Lewis Amazon is quite cheap if you bought through Lego store delivery it costs you uh, 4 pound 3 pound but if you use top cash back, you get your money back at least for the postage. Uh, this one I bought from Amazon. A cool, cool stuff. A lot of good review. Initial price, I think around £22. I got this one around £19 or £20 from Amazon. It's uh, 2010, if I not mistake, uh, modem number 8085. The reason I bought this one, I checked in Lego store. It, it classified or categorized this... Uh, set in exclusive or hard to find uh, and then I decide to go to Lego store today try to look anything sale or bargain stuff I got this one for five uh, five for two set for two two magnet the good thing is when I check on eBay when people bought this one they remove the the magnet they just take the the minifigure and then they sell it on eBay again for two two pound per piece, you know. So if this one two fifty, you sell it two pound per piece, you get six pound minus e eBay probably two pound postage and eBay fee or PayPal. You say let's say three pound, you get three pounds. So you you get three pound, you know, fifty pence uh, profit there. But in you know, but you probably get more. It depends how you listing on eBay. And then I'm probably going back to Lego store tomorrow to buy more for these two. You know, part of the trolling all the money. The good thing is, when you collect all this stuff, if you doesn't have money, just put it on eBay. Somebody will buy it. Trust me. I did with uh, my camera. I bought. Uh, I I I used to have Leica Deluxe for. I bought around five hundred something. Uh, recently, I just sold the Leica on eBay. You know, I get half the price. So at least after two years, half the price. I think is it's good price. It's not bad. Okay guys, I hope I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, do check out my other stuff. Uh, comment or share the same idea or different idea, or whatever your opinion on this collection stuff, whether it's worth it or not. And uh, see you guys in next time. Bye bye.